We would love to have your help in improving the game by contributing usage data. This only includes information on how you play the game and does not involve any personal identification data or unique device information. Contributing usage data is optional and you can opt out at any time. In the game settings menu, please review our privacy policy. Yes, we want to see that you're playing it for 20 hours straight or some nonsense. Always settings before anything else. Hello, Tilda, Tilda, Tilda. Hello, hello. see about that. Well, it's because your tummy was not used to that and it thought it was something unwanted, so it's trying to push it out as fast as it can. Be lucky, be very happy it wasn't something else. Like, I have taken a, a zinc supplement when I was ill. Not ill, ill, but you know, like, like I was going to be sick, so I wanted to fight it. A zinc supplement on an empty stomach. Your body thinks it's poison, and you will vomit out so hard. It's it's unpleasant. Dialogues. That'd be background dialogues. Yeah, it wasn't. I mean, once it's out, it's out. Once once your body knows it's gone, it's it's over with. But it's not fun. It's like an uncontrollable feeling that you have to throw up and you can't stop it. That's what it feels like to be poison, I guess. I don't ever want to find out, but thank you. What's this dialogue? Which is it? Dialogue is with someone you're talking to. Voices is ambient, I'm guessing. Let's put the book at 85. Sound effects down or music. About 80. Okay. So I want the music below voices of any kind. better than half quality. Yes. Okay. Um normal. Look like a world between worlds. <laughs> that 
didn't sound painful at all. Good. You can adjust the game difficulty at any time. Good. I prefer when games do that because you never know what you're getting into until you start doing it. Maybe you want it more difficult. You don't know. Okay, it's gonna start. That was not a soft landing. Whoa. Drop like that. Sure shouldn't feel like a million bucks. And yet, I kind of do. That doesn't look like a prison uniform shirt. Jeez. soldier okay don't panic jumping dimensions is supposed to fry half of your brain that's hilarious i don't recognize this place damn it maybe some fresh air will jump start my synapses yeah hold on a sec synapses that was synapses that's hilarious they didn't alter that. They didn't need to, but you I hear this? A word like synapses and not the first thing about what I'm doing here. That like jet of air? It's because later on he's supposed to be, he's supposed to be wearing a jetpack, and that's the sound of the jetpack. That's the sound of the jetpack you're hearing that you get later on. That is hilarious. That is hilarious. I mean, I understand it. I mean, like 99.987% of the game, he's going to have it. So why take it out at the beginning? But still, it's hilarious. You'll see later on when he has a check pack. You won't hear any difference. <laughs> Maybe a little bit louder. That's hilarious. Because we all know that when we jump in the air, there's no sound. When we come down, sure. Maybe overlook bug. It's just something they didn't. Damn. It, it's a sound they added, and they didn't think That's to take it away easily. for the beginning. Beautiful. Could be. <sighs> like a janky ha ha type of thing. Well, that's not truly frightening. You know the way? Huh. I am right behind you, little one. Alright, little Jar Jar Binks, that was lead the way. Scary alien technology. I hope that ship didn't decimate my unit. <laughs> yeah, see this blue circle? It always tells you where you're going to land. Been doing it for a while. Thank you. Oh, Jesus, my head is splitting. See, there's a part of me that wants to explore, but since I can't do anything but jump. Okay, focus on logic. There's no way the WFA would send a field operative empty handed. Something must have happened before I got here. Too badly hurt. I don't know. I hope they'll be able to. Nay, Lapta. Whoa. <laughs> Easy now. I come in peace. I assume. You. 
You speak Aga Kamon? Yeah, I was trained to speak 14 languages, but I've never heard of it. <gasps> All right, I speak Aga Kamon, sure. Which is English. <laughs> it's just a letter. Take off your shirt. Say again? Show me the Zokram amulet. We only just met. You got me confused with someone else. I travel from another dimension, and... Uh, how can I put this simply? You are human? Yes. Good. You're way ahead of me, because I don't know what species you are. The Ulukai should know about Talans. So who are you? The name's Slade. Commander of Cutter Slade. finger monster, or by the yods, I'll make a trophy out of your deformed hand. Okay, no handshakes. I meant it as a friendly gesture. Listen, that word you just said, finger it's like echoing in my head. Finger monster? <laughs> no, the other one. U Ulukai? I have a feeling we were supposed to meet. The prophecy mentions a human savior returning the Zokrum amulet. You don't seem to know anything about that. Yeah, well, my memory took a momentary hike. What happened with that ship I saw? Invaders have enslaved the Talans and are threatening the land of my ancestors. Without the guidance of the Ulukai, Adalfa is doomed. So we're on Adalfa, huh? Impressive. And it definitely rings a bell. I am Liaz, leader of the Dolotai Guardians. The invaders have just abducted one of my people. If the Yods are on your side, you'll save her. I need proof that you are the Ulukai. I can't remember my mission briefing, so... Fine. Lead the way, Liaz. Yeah, the music was built specifically for this game. I love it when they do that, because you, you can tailor it specifically. There's no time to waste. My Dolotai guardians have tracked the enemy's ship. The invaders have taken the prisoner into their outpost ahead. May the odds guide your fist, human. This fist? You're not even gonna lend me your spear? I shall not influence the trial. That's just peachy. <laughs> Please tell me that these invaders are just gonna throw coconuts at me. Reverting bolts of fire shot at lightning speed. Is that what coconuts are? No. Yeah. No. <sighs> not exactly. Now you're a little bit. No ifs, no buts, no coconuts. Hello? You... are not strange looking at all. Okay. find this Dalatai guardian. They say exercise is good for the brain anyway. Ooh, okay. Not good. Okay. Ah, fuck hell shit. You know, it'd be nice if they had a shade of different color than the rest of the landscape. I wonder if they had somebody on the way. like nothing else I'm sure huh, what's this I've never seen anything like it <sighs> I 
No. Impressive tech. Better be careful. Are you sleepy? These bots got what was coming to them. Wonder if the dollars I got. Oh, that's not scary at all. Those look like. Yes, they're like. Robots. Yep. That's what it is. Well, at least they're supposed to look like. I don't know if they actually if they actually are. Could be an exoskeleton suit. Because I'm here to tell you, if you build a robot, or robots are building themselves, they're not going to purposely make them look like humanoid shape. It's not efficient. We know from building robots ourselves, insect shapes or something like that is more efficient. Not a living thing here. I wonder what these invaders look like. size fits all. Woohoo! Well, they say jump, I say how high. Here. It's more, but it's basically the same thing. Get yeah, three dodgers per bar. Should keep moving. She can't be far. Height, it's uh, more straightforward on a horizontal plane. Another one of these That's buildings. Vertical. Gotta get inside. Can only be good. Oh, great. Now what? Now that has to be a weapon. To open this door. This gear is more advanced than anything I've seen before. Ah, shield. <laughs> nice. All right. You try shooting me now. <sighs> Damn it. Can't get through this. Thank you. 
terminals to open doors. Looks like some kind of terminal. Huh. The shield device is reacting to it. See, it looks like a human side there. See the skin with the neck? Yeah, it looks like a human. See that? On his neck? Oh, shit. There might be a very small amount of humanoid or human people with. See, that's a human language. I knew it. It can't be. Alpha 32, report. Commander, are you under attack? Report. Yeah. Humans. The invaders of my people. Good luck explaining that little detail to Liaz. Well, I guess you won't be needing this anymore, pal. Figures. Like they said, when this game, this is a second version of this game. They said it was 20 years ago when they made it, 99 or more. Uh, basically, it's Avatar before Avatar was Avatar. Let's see if the scanner is working. X-ray vision. How cool is that? Okay, Mrs. Computer. Let's see what happens when I press these keys. Shows four hostiles. Oh, two to shoot your gun. By the gun, to increase its damage. Okay. Where is that bot coming from? Well, this time it's for real.
There it is. I wish they had a better lock on function. You think this technology they would have it? Instead, you have to actually like put the X there and move you until you are lined up. It's a bit janky, but that's pretty much how it was last game. I got game. a bad feeling about this. Well, you mean both? I hope I'm not too late. Lady, I had this. You didn't have to sacrifice yourself. WFA. That's the army. I... Why do I have the feeling that I'm playing for the wrong team? So WFA that's how it should work. Now. Oh. Well, I, I guess we can't talk. I have a feeling I know what is going on. When she died, she turned into energy. And it was the same color as you see that. It? Yeah? How do you turn it off? Huh? Goddamn savage. Basically, it's like Dark Crystal. Speak. They're turning them into energy. Wrong answer. And wrong freaking language. Again! <laughs> I found out by accident or something like that. If we can't teach you English, what good are you? Sir, there's been an attack. What? Where? District 54. We lost contact with the infantry station there. Send a repair team now. And activate visual monitoring in our main facilities. Me <laughs> Their babbling is like nails on a chalkboard. They're hiding something. Find out what it is. And bring me another prisoner. Ass monkey. Ow. Who are these people? Though when he dies, he goes back to the in-between. HMM goes PPL is the real savage. Well, so that wasn't a dream. My explanation would be they're human, so humans could be both wonderful and really fucked up. Dad? Dad, is that you? What? I'm a father? <laughs> Right here. Uh, stay put. I I'm gonna find you. Where the hell am I? That's not fair! I can't have both my daddy and my mommy leaving! You know I don't like it when you call him daddy. Come on, you're still streaming. Cool, safe. okay. And I wanna come too. It's too dangerous, baby Have a good stream. Girl. Don't worry, I'll be back in no time. I promise. Daddy promised the same thing. Camilla. I mean, Commander Slate. Sorry, Mommy. Don't be sorry. I love you. He said that too. Hmm. Camilla. I have a little girl at home. I can't stay here. She needs me. I uh, did. That was like 20 years ago. Or longer. That game time, it could be 100 years more.
It's also a little bit like John Carter. If you ever seen the movie John Carter, it's very much like that as well. Or the books. I haven't read the books yet. But it's just be very much like this. He gets transported from Earth to Mars. John Carter this of Mars. It's definitely not business as usual. And on Mars, he has abilities because... We ask. You? But I saw you revert in the explosion. Well, I'm back. But don't ask me how it works. I'm afraid your guardian friend wasn't so lucky. She took out a lot of invaders before I could get to her. Her sacrifice makes us proud. Bless her essence. And bless the Ulokai. The trial is a success. You have proven that you are protected by the Yachts. That's what they want to turn off. I don't know what the heck it is. Why are we stopping here? I need a portal to my dimension. I, I got a daughter and... I also have a daughter, and I don't want her to suffer. The Yods need you to deal with the monsters that are oppressing the Talans. Listen, I gotta tell you something about these monsters you're up against. I know all about them. They're more poisonous than the Nekar Plague. We should exterminate them all. Oh, come on. That's a bit excessive. There must be some good people among them. None deserve mercy. Not after what they did to my people. But forgive my anger, Ulakai. You wanted to tell me something. Uh, um. Memory blanked again. <laughs> yes, uh, home. Uh, how can I get back to my dimension? Only the Almael can answer that question. But Kizar is a forbidden island. Oh, my kind of place. Which way? The island is covered by a massive Hilidium shield. We call it the spear. Nothing can penetrate. That's what they want so to turn off. The yachts. Yeah, your yachts couldn't make this easy for me, huh? Maybe there is a way. The children of Kizar are suffering from a mysterious disease, and the Almayal is calling Shamazes to heal them. Uh, do I look like one of these Shamazes? No. However, you could convince one to introduce you to the Almayal. But they're going to make you work for it. Well, how about you introduce me? I scratch your back, you scratch mine kind of thing. I won't scratch you, Ulukai. <laughs> Besides, Dolatai guardians are not welcome in Kizar anymore. So, where do I start? Emea is the closest village. Ask for Shamaz Nemet. Comlink synchronizing. Synchronization complete. But what about the invaders? Uh, you leave these unidentified monsters to me. Mm hmm. They're identified. We know what they are. Okay. What's that? Where's that fog coming from? Ah, oh, crap. Edge of the game. Okay. And you still need 50. been marked on your map. Follow the direction. Yes, yes, yes. Continue. 
it's going to be that way. This isn't be start being an open world game until you. Morning. Any better today? Sound. Well, not really. It is also in my right ear now, so I don't hear that pain. However, the pain is less. Yeah. Hitting some fog. Damn it! I can't see Hell. anything ahead. Can't progress into a open world game until I actually do what exactly. it wants me to do. Mia, let's find Shamaz Nemet. You were talking about this game, right? Yep. Did you try the Steam key, babe? Steam's only good for your sinuses. If there was something wrong with that, then yeah, but you can try warm compresses on the sides of your neck below your ear. And it can uh, unblock the tubes. Reduce the swelling. Because if your ears start draining, it will the lessen the pressure. Hmm. How do you like the game so far? Actually, it's. I would prefer it was open world from the very beginning, but I can understand why they don't want it to be. They want you to learn how. Maybe I could use my scanner to look for Nemet. To do things. <laughs> but I really don't like uh, story lock stuff. I really don't like like limiting you what you can do if they tell you that you can if it's open world okay. but I can understand why they well try to get a rag and uh, soak it in really warm water wring it out and then apply it to your neck and keep doing that on the side below your ear for a sec You, want, you need to reduce the swelling inside your canal. I thought you mean shower and watch the stream. Yeah. Oh my. Oh my. Well, you know. What? Well, you know. If that's something you need, to, really need to do. Who is Perv here? I <laughs> Nemet. Of course, Foxy's answer is going to be, who do you think I learned it from? <laughs> yeah, I am gonna try. I am just glad the pain is less. Take a long hot shower. Oh my. Can you choose between male and female? 
No. Oh my. This is very much about this character in the first game, which was like 20 years ago or more. It was this guy. It's basically like Avatar or John Carter of Mars. Where's that fog coming from? Where, you know, you're this guy from another place, another time, another world. And you're sort of just dropped in the middle of this. You wake up with no memories of what was, trying to figure out what's going on. I'm full. No female char. Lady won't play it. Hey. You don't know what his orientation is. They don't say. He could be, you know, a female personality inside of this ancient old man. You don't know. No. You can treat him any way you want to. It's just a character in a game. I mean, he has a daughter. He's being very feminine towards his feelings about wanting to be with his daughter. Surely that's funny. Fun. I mean, nothing. It's fine. It's fine. Sorry to bother, but uh, I'm looking for the Shemaz of this place. Katakizai, Yats Almighty. Oh my. The lost oh language my. of Kazar's false prophecy. Who are you? Well, I'm glad you can understand me. The name's Cutter Slade. You might have heard of the Ulukai. Ulukai? <laughs> I am sorry. This is a strange moment. I haven't spoken Akakaman in many moons. I am Mehmet, Shamaz of Amiya. Nice to meet you. Listen, Leah sent me. You gotta help me out. I don't think I can but speak, and I will listen. Take care, Nemet. Dang it. Hello, Shamaz Nemet. You returned. If the game is really good, I would play it. But I rather watch a woman from behind the whole day than a man XD. Well, this is a fact. But then again, if you start doing that, then you, you get shot to death so many times. You're wondering, oh, I was, what were you doing? Um, nothing. Nothing. I definitely wasn't staring at someone's behind. And forgot all about the game. Do you think the uh, invaders can be healed? Good question. I see no essence in them. Beings with no essence cannot be healed through the essence and the odds. They cannot be reverted either. Have you tried to heal them? I don't want to get too close to them. I would probably get reverted. Huh. Even if it doesn't bleed, we can still kill it. Trust me. You speak so tough. Does everyone where you're from speak this tough? Wait, I'm not interested in this topic. <laughs> I haven't been home in a while. Tell me about the Almayel. When the Yod speak, the Almayel listens. When the Almayel speaks, the Shamas listens. When we Shamazes speak, the villages listen. Sometimes. Sometimes they ignore us and go through the same painful cycle again and again. What can you do? Oh, I know all about painful cycles. See? He menstruates. He understands about painful cycles. You never know about people. 
Listen, I know this is gonna sound crazy, but your gods, I mean Yods, brought me to your dimension for a reason. I need to know what that reason is so I can return to my family. Long story short, I gotta speak with the Almael. Only Shamazes can be invited to Kizar outside of Vokostok. <laughs> and I am a Shamaz. Amazing. Go pack your lunchbox then. We leave in ten. Hmm. I have felt the call of the Almael. Oh. The children of Kizar are sick and they need <laughs> healing. But what can a Shamaz do? The path to Kizar is long and fought with invaders. You might survive, but a Shamaz would surely revert. Look. We can kill two birds with one stone here. Once we get to this Kizar, we can figure out what to do about the kids, too. We. The spear protects the island of Kizar from all intruders. And the Almayel doesn't know you. I'm sorry. The Almayel won't meet with you. That's exactly why I need you to slip in, talk to the Almayel, and figure out how to get me home to see my own kid. Because you're right. This whole thing is about our children, right? Hmm. If one could reactivate the... I believe you call them portals? Is that the right Akakamun word for Dialkas? Then traveling from Mamiya to Kizar would be just like that. Whoosh. The space of three breaths. But Chief Hatsa won't allow it. The invaders made our Dialkas not work, you know. He can from Earth. He doesn't want to anger them yes. more. You may not have any issues with authority, but... It's very much like Avatar before Avatar. I your Daoka if it gets us to Kizar. Hmm. Helping you goes against Chief Hatso's command. I could be called a traitor. But the children are my priority, and Talans are a grateful people. We reward heroic deeds. Help us with the Daoka, and I will, how do you say, be a champion of you. Human also the ones who kidnapped them to do some shit. Yep. Doesn't sound right. Just like Avatar. Kinky. Whoa. Are you sure we even need a Daoka to travel to Kizar? Maybe you don't, but these old legs do. Retrieve the core that the invaders have stolen, and I will introduce you to the Almayel in Kizar. I gotta go now. Yachts bless you. Slay to Liaz. I spoke with the Shamaz of Amiya. Nemet, is he willing to help? Yeah, under one condition. That I turn their Daoka back on. You will need to recover its core that was stolen by the invaders. They keep it in a nearby base. You've been there? It's too dangerous for the Talans. Our weapons cannot match their firepower. I can show you where it is located. I'm on it. Thanks, Liaz. Find Emma's Dioka core. Liaz, mark the location of the Dioka core on your map. Rest. Open the quest map. Okay. Where's that? Okay. Girl wants home. Mother wants her to run. Okay. I'm so thirsty. XI drank like two jugs of water. Yep. Your body's trying to flush everything out of it. Be careful that your salt level doesn't fall too low either. Maybe the food I had got too much MSG. <laughs> yeah? If you're eating anything with MSG in it, because your body wants to flush Thirsty it out. For me. Well, that's a given, isn't it? It's not even a question. Oh, yes, I am. Okay. Thirsty for Lady twenty four slash seven. But how do you like the game so far? Well, it, they made it not open world yet until I get enough training on how it works, basically. Basically like riding a bike with training wheels. 
It's annoying if you think you can just write it without it. But Lady I bought you ask it already. She wanted more detail. Surely. I want a more detail. Okay. Okay. Okay, that looks not good. Okay, I'm going to unlock it. There you go. Yeah, it's better. It's like a compass now. I don't know what these are. You are to me. Yep, that's not good. Not good. Not good. Nope. Bad. I hear you. Bad. Oh, there's a lot of them. Look at all the dots on the mini map. Yeah, I'm not doing that. I don't need to do that, so I'm not doing that. Bad water snake. You ain't kidding. And it vomits stuff at you, probably acid. I'm gonna go with no. HMM limited ammo too. Yeah. Well, you get. Fucking crap! See, if you go outside, you get yeah, you get mod mods for your weapons as you progress through the game. But right now, if, until I finish my current mission, everything's like fog locked. If I try to go into the fog, I get teleported back, which is annoying. Ow, what the hell? Wait, what? Oh, memory. Or connection to someone else. Here you are. There's something wrong with your comm link. I turned it off. You did? What? What are you doing? We took this from them. I'm sure they'd want their relics back. We could use it to parlay. You know we don't have the clearance to do that. I came looking for you. Your father wants to see us at HQ. Maybe this mission isn't only about what he wants, Colonel. Let that sink in for a while. Okay. That's something that we need. I'm sure. Oh, another vision. Was that the Daoka core Nemet is looking for? Now, 
also has something from Mass Effect. The shield and sword thingy. I'm sure they took elements from different games that worked. Trying to make it better. And heal. And look. Okay, I'm gonna get this other crystal. Probably out of my distance. New weapon module, nice. Okay, cool. Okay, weapon module. You have to discover a new weapon module. It can be equipped to your weapon. Give it new capabilities. Where's the? Okay, I can't unlock it yet. Okay, I have them, but I can't unlock them. Fine, fine, fine. Okay, there it is. Okay. See, that is... Machine gun. Concussive shot. Shoots faster. Ah, okay, I can't talk. It's up, 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 up. Got you, got you, got you. Up. No? Okay, it's equipped. Pew pew. Okay. Oh, okay. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. Okay. Muscles over at the bottom. Okay. We got 16 of 50 left to the next one. Nano cells. Okay, good, good. Okay. Starting to pick it up. Okay. Show effects. Increases damage and chances of stunning droids. Good, good. Always good. Increases damage. Uh, it's same thing. Okay. Uh, Shoot overheated, well overheated at the cost of extra healing. Okay. If I shoot too many times, it overheats. That bot coming from. Okay. Good. And that should do the trick. Um, here we go. Portals. General Burum, you asked to see us? You can skip the decorum, sweetheart. Just call me father. Blah. Okay. Father. I don't want you on the ground anymore. The situation has escalated. What's happening, General? This footage comes from the black box recovered in one of our damaged drones. Look. A rogue no. agent? 
It's impossible. Exactly, Colonel. This is proof the savages are sorcerers. They can get in our minds, mess with our heads. Okay. Clearly, it's some kind of alien Really? Come on, father. This is getting a little ridiculous. You know it's nothing to do with the fact that You're the someone actually has some morals to or ethics. A single prisoner. Yet you keep assuring me these primates are intelligent. We're taking over primates. their land. Just because they don't welcome us doesn't mean they're stupid. Yep. This is General Borum. Of Tilda, the general Send is the ass Tilda. All bases. <laughs> do it now. Oh, yes. I really hope they don't humanize them. In other words, they don't. Like when you're about to kill him or something, you don't find out something. Like there's a good reason why he's the bad man. He's just trying to do good things in a bad way. Looks like the no, 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 thank you. Don't mix niceness anyway, with my villains, thank you. Thanks for the heads up, General. Ulakai, as expected, your presence didn't go unnoticed. Some Talans are already talking about you. Oh, yeah? Well, what do they say? Because I can't... There is always a reason why they are doing it. understand you either. Only the Shamas they speak after come on. Shamas is only then. I'll keep that in mind. Slate out. Tilda. Yeah. There's reasons. But it doesn't make it a good reason. Oh, Tilda. I mean, if his reason is that. Savage. Of course, he's one of those people that, if you're not technologically advanced, then you must be a savage. Well, maybe they don't need to be technologically advanced. They don't feel a need to subdue their environment. Maybe they've figured out, you know what? We can learn to live with our world. Isn't that amazing? more people think like that I don't know you always hope that maybe one day people will learn to behave themselves unfortunately a lot of greedy and selfish PPL hmm facts There's a song called One Tin Soldier, which is a story song. It just pretty much describes the way humans are. We always see something we want, and we try to take it from some people, even if they're offering it to us. Because, you know, that's not good enough. We have to take it. Want to change the world, start with yourself. Facts. Actually, I think it's a Chinese proverb that you... If you want to be a leader, first you have to be in, learn how to properly be in charge of your family. You know, start small. Yourself, then your family, then, you know, your neighborhood. You just can't go in and choose to treat people any way you want. True. Start with herself. Lady taught me stuffs a lot. Oh my, I don't doubt that. I that is why you're together. Quite 
I have no idea. I have no doubt that she taught you so much. No doubts. No doubts. She oh my. Me a lot too. Oh my. But yes. I'm full. You are such a perv. <laughs> what? 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 I'm disagreeing with you. You, you, you teach each other, and and hopefully you know once you teach someone something, you have to practice. So there's much practicing and teaching. So you know, I'm happy. The way you say it. <laughs> Whatever do you mean? Perfect. Practicing. Of course, you just can't teach someone something and not have them have an experience of, you know. A lot of practice. Yeah. Yeah. E. load up on crystal I know it does something it might be the healing crystal that I need for firing my weapon yeah, I'd rather have it than not have it In Stargate, this would be the Chapa Eye. to Costa Rica, Black Ops. You know I couldn't check it for her birthday. It's... It's just too hard on Camilla. The longing, the questions. You can't show up unannounced and then disappear again for God knows how long. What, what are you saying? That I should stop coming? Not like this. You're either in or out of her life. You understand? That's the job, Wolf. You, if anyone, should understand that. I do understand. So, please do not come back until you receive the paperwork from the lawyer. Um... Hello? I'm pretty sure your daughter would rather have a father that wants to be there, but can't. As opposed to one that can be there, but won't. Who's there? I want out of this. You can trust me. True. Holy shit. Minutes. 
I must have taken a little dimensional detour or something. So, this is the place? Behold, the spear. He was in between for a month. Wherever a moon is for them. Impressive. But I'm still counting on you. You'll keep your promise, right? Oh, this is gonna be wrong. We actually passed through. Wow, surprise! Hey there! Run away! Run away! I still have sick children to tend to. The Amayel will see you now. Thanks, Nemet. Don't thank me yet, Ulukai. That was the easy part. Yeah, you can see it on the map. You see all that white squiggly on the mini-map? That's the fog. Which means I'm not allowed to go anywhere except for where I'm supposed to go. Hopefully that clears up. This is a big place for just one. So you're the mysterious stranger. The Almayel sees you, human. Speak your Aga come on words, and the Almayel shall listen. Uh, I'm confused. Which one of they you are. is the? Almayel. I am the Almayel, one luminous being, the ruler of Adelpha, the precious link between Talans and the Yards. I see. I'm only here because I'd like to go back to my dimension. But your Yards? Well, they seem to want something else. I think they're trying to tell me something. Blasphemy! Only the Almayel can hear the voice of the Yards. Why would the Yards address a human? Maybe this Ulukai thing? The Yards, they've shown me things like visions. Oh, and I heard a voice, yeah. Uh, I'm not even sure if it's if that. Lies! lies. Humans, humans are liars. liars. Leave, Leave this, this sacred, sacred sanctuary, sanctuary at, at once. once. No, wait! The Almayel has, has spoken. spoken. Hold on. Liaz told me that you could answer my questions. Liaz. The sound of that name casts ripples on the perfect surface of Melia. It shall not be spoken in Kizar. All right, look. I meant no disrespect, but I have a message from your yachts, okay? I'm sure you want to hear it. Let's work something out and you can help me get off this rock. Speak now or leave. Do we have a deal? Speak! Okay, so it goes something like this. Nas your cat. I'm a not mm, nectar. Yards, Yards Almighty. Almighty. You see, <laughs> I told you it was important. Imposter! Imposter. How, How dare, dare you mock the Amayel? <sighs> Look, I'm working on my accent. All right, listen to me. I have died, actually died okay but i keep waking up in some kind of vortex with this echo the same words repeating nas your cat no nas your cat amanor nikar bond is broken well that was something That's more like it the message speaks, Agazark. 
So, so it, it is true. You, you hear, hear the, the voice, voice of the, of the gods. gods. Hearing was the easy part. Care to translate? Oh, wait. I think I already know what it means. Save, Save us, us from, from extinction. extinction. How do I? What language am I speaking? The Yards have translated the message. The Almayel sees and hears what is left to comprehend. To save us from extinction, we must protect. Kizar must be protected to save the Talans from extinction. Kizar must procreate to save the Talans from extinction. So, which one is it? The Elmael is... Not of one mind anymore. One luminous being. Not anymore. Looks like it takes at least two to disagree. Not my place to debate, but you got your message, so what about our deal? Save us from extinction. And the Yards will send you back to your world. One man against an army. <laughs> Yards can't be serious about this. You two don't strike me as someone who would get their sense of humor, so... Hey, where's she going? There's no... They're, long, they're no longer united. Broken bond? Yeah. It's gonna be, have to be one of the things he fixes, too. Not just... Everything else, but he's gonna have to fix that bond. I'm sure. Talk? The Almayel sees you. Sorry, lady. Who are you again? The Almayel, protector of life and the Oracle of the Yards. So you and your sister have never disagreed before? Ever? The Almayel is one luminous being. The incarnation of Melia on Adelpha. She doesn't disagree. The dissonance in the Almayel's voice is something else. We call it Sankra. The path is blurry. Aka stalk, the spear. One renews, the other one protects. Protecting is saving. Technically, males and females mingling renews life. That's saving, too. But I think you both may be interpreting this the wrong way. Who are you to criticize our ways? The Almayel has ruled Adelpha for thousands of cycles far before your arrival. I I'm not looking to offend anyone. The ladies have run this world for thousands of years, and I'm sure you have the best reasons to do it your way. I don't want to interfere with your politics. I'm just a guy who wants to get home. A guy? You are the message. You brought Sankra into the temple of the Almayel, shrouding your true intentions. Denying you is the path of the blind, but obeying you is merely a one-eyed vision. Could we maybe agree that my name is not Message? <laughs> if the Yods are giving me a ticket back to my daughter, I'll do everything I can to save you from extinction. But I believe the shortcut to the endgame is shutting down the invader bases, one by one. No invaders, no threat on your people. That's your message in a nutshell. The message is already changing. The other eye... I wonder if you make babies with her, how they will look. That's cryptic. Oh my? Who's the other eye? Your sister? Mm -hmm. The Almayel has half spoken. Not a yes, not a no. Okay. I thought the spear was already protecting this island. But you seem to think the Yods want it even more protected? How? You must understand that this can only be half. Half spoken. Got it. You asterisk don't want your sister knowing the details. My lips are sealed. Asterisk. Just lay it on me. This island is built on the largest source of white helidium in all of Adelpha. The Almayel uses it to power the spear. But it's depleting quickly and won't mm. last forever. If they are willing to help, the Dalatai Guardians could find a way to bring more white helidium to the island. Understood. I'll talk to Liaz. If that's what it takes to redeem the Guardians, she'll be all for it. Dalatai Guardians are outcasts. 
their outlawed order started our descent into extinction. This wants to see your daughter. Ishana and Leaz share the same fey essence, as did Yan, her former partner, who reverted so many Dalatai guardians in his foolish attempt at violence. Was it really foolish to sacrifice themselves to save you all? You among all people should appreciate the value of protection. You need to listen to Liaz, because this is how the invaders are winning right now. They divide and rule. Divide and rule? Words of Sankra. And yet the Almayel sees wisdom in them. Wisdom's good. If the message can convince the Dalatai Guardians to protect the spear, the Almayel will half speak in their favor, and Liaz shall be heard. Thank you. Thank you for that bit of mercy. The Almayel has half spoken. It was We're good done. talking to you, Almayel. I have to leave now. Walk where the yards can see you. We asked, you read me. Yes, Ulukai. The Dolatai Guardians will help you. How do you... I haven't said anything. When you were talking to the Elmael, you left your channel open. <laughs> After studying the map, I've identified several facilities that are storing copious amounts of white telidium. I can clear the outpost. Can you send your people to collect after me? Sure. But there's a problem. Uh, of course there is. <laughs> white telidium can't pass through a donka. Small amounts are fine, but it gets unstable in large quantity. The Daoka could explode and obliterate the area, just like in Talanzar, 15 cycles ago. Any safer option? We could use a fisher Talan boat. I can centralize the shipments in the coastal village of Sapa. That will take some coordination, but it can be done. Oh, you think they'll do it? If I'm ever gonna get home, we need to find a way for everyone to contribute. Y'all got no advanced weapons, no vehicles, no protection. Oh, there's not much to work with here. Talons are resourceful. I'm sure every village has something to offer. You just have to figure out what exactly. Talk to the chiefs. It shouldn't be too difficult now that you're fluent in our language. What are you talking about? Ulukai, you do realize we're having this discussion in Agazork. Really? <laughs> Wild. The odds did something to me. Yep. I have a feeling they're only getting started. They rewired your brain. So Six when you speak board, English, yes. you're actually speaking their language. Slayed out. There's only a limited amount of people can speak Earth English. But now he can they can be understood by everybody. May new main quest unlocked. Where's that? Going. All right. Save from extinction. Yeah, this is what these 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 two things are. Be two halves of what they want. This one now is what she wants. The one sister, the one that's blurred out, I can't access yet. It's going to be what the other sister wants. And we're going to have to accomplish both of them in order to get things going. Okay. That's where I am. You got to talk to the other one? Yeah, I would think so. They are two halves of one whole. Yeah, now I'm going to have to eventually do it because... Oh, hello? Statues. Yes, thank you. Is that the one? Alright. 
You have returned. About the echoes, you heard them too, right? It's like the Yods are in my head. The Yods are not in your head, human. They are everywhere. Well, I we need to do them both or two. Looping the same message both. over and over again. It's. Oh, it's what I hear every time I. You don't hear the message. You are the message. Powerful words spoken by the Yods. To hear the message is to understand it like a true Urukai would. I hate choosing. You don't have to choose. From the commercial, it's not enough to do just protect the planet. You have to connect the planet. You have to find out how every single creature is connected to every single thing. Just like on like Avatar type of thing. And then once you know how all everything's connected, you can save the entire planet. Can you give Leah a second chance? She'd like to just talk with you. The Almayel can't hear Liaz. She is an outcast. The Dalatai guardians fell under their own false prophecies, and the Yods reclaimed their tainted lessons of war. Listen, you can't blame her for something her lover did. They had good intentions, right? The Dalatai guardians are not the enemy, the invaders are. Liaz learned nothing from Yan's reversion. As long as she bangs the drum of war, Kizar will be off-limits to her. The spear protects the Talan race from the violent nature of Sankra and all the dissident voices. We will continue the circle of life. That's the will of Chaos. the Yards. The message speaks of saving all the Talans from extinction. That's right. Every Talan. Liaz included. So help me save her. Let bygones be bygones. Please. You don't understand. This can't be. The Almayel has already have spoken. Excuse me, who are you again? The Almayel, nurturer of life, an oracle of the Yods. What's so special about this place, Kizar? Kizar has been a sacred haven for thousands of cycles. It is where every Talan life begins, and Melia's last bastion. Without Kizar, there would be no Adelpha. Then that's it. Like Zokrim predicted, I'm the Ulukai. Why else would the Yods bring me back here? There is no Ulukai. Not yet. I'm sorry you and the Dalatai Guardians were fooled by the false prophecies of Khazar and Zokrim. They were wrong interpretations of the Yod's way. Only the Almayel reads the will of the Yod's. Wait, what? You don't believe in the prophecy? But you believe that an Ulukai is still gonna come? <laughs> I gotta tell you, reading between the lines ain't my thing. The Almayel... I... Cannot be more clear. The Ulukai must hear the message and Enjoy understand gaming. its true meaning. I am gonna you eat all the meds and so walk doggo. Maybe sire yeah, later. Maybe the word all right. is getting lost in translation here. Take care. This is not clear at all. My point exactly. Good see you, my lady. Yeah, basically. Could you imagine switched. just for one second that I am the hero you guys are waiting for? Sounds a tad pretentious, I'll give you that, but... You are the message. Words of the Yods. Leave their true meaning to the Elmael. Even though you and your sister can't agree on the meaning of four words. Save us from extinction. Silence. Akastok shall be. Extinction shall be avoided. The Almayel has half spoken. Why do you think procreation is the key to the Yod's message? The Almayel understands the voice of the Yod's, and they want Akastok to be celebrated again. She has a boyfriend. That's why she's separate. 
What's Okastock? The festival celebrates or girlfriend the or whatever. Of she has a Can't you she's hear? separate that way. Birth is silent. Thousands of moons without new life leads to extinction. Complete the circle, follow the will of the yards, and the message shall become. What do you mean, become? Become what? The message can't be trusted until it brings the first Daraman to the Almayel. The first of many. Okay, she won't think of him as the Ulakai until he starts doing what she wants. What's a Daraman exactly? A Daraman is a symbol of Talan unity. The festival of Akastok can't happen while the villages of Adelpha remain isolated. Help them. Unite the people behind their leaders. And you shall receive their Daromans in return. Yeah, it should be I have to go now. For now, the yards are waiting. Yep, that's the other one. Yeah, I steal the white helidium from the boxes and I help the villages. There's no time limit, supposedly. I'm doing any of this. So if I want to, and I suggest that you do this, you help the villages so they get in favor of you and they give you things, which makes it easier to fight. All right, Tilda, I gonna sleep. Almost 12 a.m. here, see ya, Fezzik. Lady? How about your lady? Okay. Nimet, how are the children? I healed them, but I couldn't find the cause of the disease. So I'm afraid I'll have to return if the stomach cramps start again. But duty calls in my village too, so I should head back to Emiya now. Speaking of Emiya, you don't have a spare Daramon, do you? I'm gonna need a bunch of them, and frankly, I got no idea where to start. My village is as good a starting point as any if you're on the lookout for Daramons. Emiya has its share of issues like every other place on Adelpha, I'm sure. Help us and I will bless our Daramon myself. Or help other villages first, because by the odds, the whole of Adelpha needs help. <laughs> well, I have a portal to Emma. Open the Toka map by pressing on the quest map. Okay, wow. You can now fast travel to any activated Dioka from the map. Oh wow, this is like the in-between. This is so wicky. That's another Dioka. Not that far away. Interesting, okay. That's an interesting way to fast travel. Hopefully a month has it passed again. You'll need to gain the trust of inhabitants. Let's open the quest map. Select the village of Emma to open its quest log. Okay, I did that. And this chief and track missing. Okay.
locate. Oh wow, that's gonna be all the things they want me to do. Yay. Yeah. Yeah, I may not be able to go out horizontally. Maybe I can now, but... Hi. Can I have a minute? Of course! see that statue was worth something for some reason but reculium helium I think I better avoid vertical exploring until I get more upgrades from my jetpack. Ulukai, are you hearing me? Always. Emerheed, one of my Dolotai guardians, came across an ancient altar. Can you take a look? Marking its position on the map. Yeah, sure. If you think it's important. You, yes, that'll be an upgrade. I think it's connected to the Essence Shrine nearby. I found similar altars before, but never figured out how the ancients were using them or why. Say no more. You got me intrigued. Ulakai, if Emerheath's intel is right, 
There should be an ancient altar close to your location. Can you find it? Ancient altar? Sure. I'll have a look. Slate out. Hey, hey. Hello, Shamaz Nemet. What in the yachts? I didn't realize it before, but how did you learn to speak Agasaurus so fast? Wait, is that a Shamazar accent I'm hearing? Really? I think the Yachts did something to me when I delivered their message to the Almael. Oh, I see. Praise them. Be careful, Ulukai. Activating the Daokas has caught the invaders' attention. Can you heal me? Brace yourself. The Yachts guide my hands. So, where is that Daramon of yours? And how can I score it quick? Aeneas Daramon doesn't exist yet. The chief of the village creates a Daramon as a token of gratitude. Speak to my fellow Talans, and they will tell you how you can help them. If you're a good friend to Aeneas, it's Daramon you shall receive. Good luck with that, so, though. Yeah. How to make friends on alien worlds. I must have left that book on the shelf. I'll try my luck here and in other places I come across, too. Remind me what a Shamaz does. I heal wounds of the flesh. Lately, my wounds have been filled with healing harvesters who fall from the trees. Sorry, can you tell me who you are again? Of course. I am Nemet, the Shamaz of Emiya. Take care, Nemet. That's gonna be one of the things. That fruit I shot at. I'm gonna have to figure out a way to help the harvesters harvest it better. Okay, there's this one where it's just a dash jump. I prefer, it would be nice if there was a jump dash. You look important. Can I have a minute? Wherever you come from, they must have taught you how to properly address a chief. I am Hatsu, leader of the MA. And who might you be, funny one? Funny one. Thank you. Tell me who you are again. I am Hatso, you simpleton. Ah. Leader of Emir. What are you up to? I work hard to keep Emir out of trouble. No, My you people don't. are counting on me. I am their leader. Those invaders everyone's worried about. Have you fought them? Why would I? I want to stop negotiations with them to ensure Emir's safety. Negotiations? You see what they're doing out there. They'll take your land and enslave you. Don't spit your violence at me. You want us to provoke the invaders. Emir is peaceful. We sell fruit. Nothing more. Listen, Chief Hatso, the Yod sent me here for a reason. I can help if you let me. Have you ever walked through the charred ruins of the Procreana Library? Scattered in the dirt are the remains of a hundred victims. There are no martyrs in Emir, and no heroes. We don't need any Ulukai here. That oh, is why this we is live. going to be extra fun. Okay. Just how are the negotiations going? I haven't met one that I could have a conversation with so far, but I am committed to making the effort. I believe the invaders have some unfinished business in Desan. I just want to send them a signal that we are willing to collaborate. If it collaborators, oh departure. joy. Where I come from, they don't like collaborators during a war. War? Would you stop with the violence? There are no warriors here. Now go. 
I'm Cutter Slade. Not sure if you've heard of me. Ah, uh, yes, the Ulukai I've been warned about. Warned. Emir is not interested in your stories. I would offer you a delicious morag on your way out, but supplies are limited. Just give me a minute. What are you afraid of? I was elected supreme in front of the Yobs. I am not afraid of anything. Now listen. We already have one useless troublemaker in this village. We don't need another. Who is that? You haven't met Doc yet. He's by the lake. You should visit him and swap your ridiculous stories about saving the planet. What's your take on Doc? Our Doc? The son of Kazmir? Fools breed fools. And I despise fools. What more can I say? Self-important ass. What happened in Progriana? It was Adelpha's center of knowledge and science. Until those stupid Dolotite guardians arrived to wreak havoc. They convinced the recreators to help them storm the invaders' bases and fight with everything they had. They lost. The recreators all reverted. I'm smart enough to see that war never works. As long as I am leader, Amir will not fight. Yeah, we need to change that. What can you tell me about Kazmir? He was obsessed with prophecies. The kind of stories told by the late Dolotai guardians. He dragged me on an excursion once to marvel at some stupid stone with runes he probably etched himself to get attention. I'm sad his son has followed in his footsteps. <sighs> That's it. Always a pleasure to see you leave. Oh, 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 oh. I'm worried about you. That's the essence shrine. Okay. Okay. Where are you? I'm still in Amia. You heard about some troublemaker named Doc? Cosmere's son. Doc is a good talon. Maybe a little lost, unsure of his essence, like his whole generation. What's wrong with this generation? Let me guess. It's those damn video games. No. There hasn't been a conversion <laughs> ceremony in a dozen cycles. It's too dangerous to bring our youth to the well of essence. So these young Talons have no essence? Everyone has an essence. They're just not sure which of the four essences are theirs. The ceremony is meant to reveal exactly that. Well, I was a teenager once. It can get pretty confusing. They figure it out. Eventually. Slate out. Ulukai, I'm right here. Gods be praised. Leos told me I'd have a chance to find you here. The Ulukai. I can't believe you're real. We have waited for so long. You didn't travel all that way just to greet me, unless I'm like one of the beetles in your world, which I totally understand. Beetles? Sounds mysterious. My name is Emerhid, and believe it or not, I happen to be the Dalatai Guardian heading the research group that focuses on Adelpha's ancient mysteries. I guess you've heard about the Essence Shrines? Maybe I did, but my memory ain't... Okay, let's assume I didn't. So, what about them? What about them? What about them? I, I don't know. I really hoped you'd enlighten us, Ulukai. Well... Sorry to disappoint, then. Let me mark these locations on the map. I believe they're essence shrines. And hopefully you'll help crack their mystery for us. The odds are trying to tell us something, I can feel it. If you come across more of them, please let me know. Chief Hatsur doesn't want me here, so I'm heading back to the Dalatai camp near the Gandar temple. Find me there. Okay, Emerheed. 
Maybe I'll look into it. <laughs> Maybe. Zakur didn't tell us you'd be so funny, Ulukai. Of course you'll look into it. Do you know how many essence shrines are out there? I have a few documented here. I'm sure you're still a long way from uncovering them all. All right. See you next time, Emerheed. Okay. He said he was down by the water. Lifted. You have a helium to unlock a new jetpack upgrade. Yes, yes, I will. Thank you. So I got another bar. Good, good. good. Must be the essence shrine Lee has told me about. Stay on, stay on. Yes, I did it. Looks like I unlocked some ancient mausoleum. Let me try to describe it to you. I see where you are. One of the essence shrines. You're inside it? Yup. Praise the yods. We knew essence shrines were important, but never found a way to enter them. I can't wait to tell Emerheed about it. it. Looks like the ancients left us a treat. Sweet. There are more essence shrines throughout Adelpha. If you unlock this one, I bet you could unlock them all. Talk to Emerheed at the Dolotai camp if you want to know more. I'll keep that in mind. Thanks, Lias. Slate out. Okay. Uh, 
don't need a fast travel. Dang it. I don't need a fast travel there. I just need to go my direction. Nah, stop it. I'm pointing the right direction, it seems. the way I want to do things, but I'm going to get back to town. They're on me. Shit. Oh, just that one thing. Vomiting things at me. No, thank you. No, 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 no. So that was red helium, which is an upgrade. This will be around dangerous places like that. Okay. Upgraded by health. Okay. Hey there, uh, can we talk? Greetings, stranger. My name is Moore. Have you come to register? Register. For what, exactly? You know what? Forget it. I can tell by your hands you're not capable of working here. You're that Ulakai, are you not? You'd think the odds would bestow you with better hands. Um, what's wrong with them? Too many things. We do real work in the treetops. Oh, ho. He's not an ass, he's just very sure of what he does. Not too much. I went and opened up a temple guide and a health upgrade. Where can I find Doc? He usually hangs around the shops. The merchants trick him into buying useless junk like clunky diving equipment and other things that never work. Or you can look for him at his father's cabin by the lake, northwest from here. He okay. is probably exploring those lakes like his father before him. Not swimming, that's for sure. He'd revert himself in a bucket of water. I don't know what he does. <laughs> Some secret project. He should be up here, gathering armfuls of morags for the next convoy. In a bucket of water. That's so messed up. I just wonder what kind of job would require big, I mean, strong fingers like yours. I guess it's your first time in Amia. On these trees, we cultivate the most delicious morags on Adelpha. My name is Moore. I am the Grand Foreman of the Harvester Union. Oh, really? Grand Foreman? Sounds important. Harvesters are more than simple farmers. The best morags grow close to the moons, on the tops of the highest trees. Very dangerous to gather. Only young, vigorous Talans can reach them. In my early moons, I would dance across the branches without fear. But now, the heights make me dizzy. So I took on new responsibilities. Tell me more about Casimir. You know enough. I don't want to waste any more words on losers. Sorry, who are you again? I am Moore, Chief Harvester of Emir. What are you doing here? When I'm not supervising the harvest, I'm recruiting new workers for the treetops. Are you and Hatso friends? There are no friends in politics. Hatso's Amir's leader. 
but he believes we can negotiate with the enemy. Amir is lucky the invaders are not after Mora. Sounds like you're in the opposition party, Mora. Are you campaigning for village leader? Each ground citizen of Amir has the right to challenge the leader in front of the yards. I did. Twice. But I failed. They say three is the magic number. The citizens of Amir still see me as the unworthy Talan from the treetops. No matter how low I descend, I still need better Morag numbers so I can prove my value to them. Okay, good. I had to get him in Time charge, probably. Buy more. Uh, northwest of here, I'd say. Is it open world already or still quest locked? Well, according to this, it's open world within this territory. And once I unlock more portals, I'll be able to fast travel between other ones. This is the closest one I've seen in this territory. And this is the Essence Shrine, which was thankfully fairly easy I was able to unlock it there's a demo you can download of this game and you can play each version there's like three different like uh one's open world there's three different slots one's open world one's quest and one's combat you can play each of them for 20 minutes at a time but then you have to start over again when they first had that demo they actually Nothing, not, I haven't seen this before. They updated the demo. So now, it used to be that you could only play each one 20 minutes at a time, twice, and that was it. You couldn't play the demo ever again. Now it's unlocked, and you can play each one 20 minutes at a time as much as you want. So you get the feel of what the game is like. Which was a wise move on their part. You won't have progression because you can only play it for 20 minutes. But you get the idea that you get the idea of the feel of that. OK, do I want to buy this game? Do I want to play this game? If you can keep doing it like you, if you get that feeling like you want to progress and get the progression, then you have to buy the game. OK. watch you play it i am waiting for dragon's dogma next week good oh they have a demo of that also this is a character creator demo of dragon's dogma 2 for ps5 you can download it and i guess you create your own character maybe that carries over into the game so if you want to get a jump on that look in the demo section for dragon's dogma 2 and you can get a jump on your uh, building your character and hopefully they'll carry carry over you'll already be set when you when the game comes out hello crystals Is true but i can wait for that because i am gonna stream it of course <laughs> 
Is that part? Okay. I haven't plucked some of these in a while. I need that. That's just not bad. of space first. Oh, really? Let's see. Okay. Well, I'm fine with that. I really have a full inventory of health packs and an empty one. Okay. happening here oh my god i can't believe it did the yard send you to meet with doc i wish i knew the odds are being a bit vague with me who's doc i am doc search no more this is the place wow the place what are you doing here <sighs> surely the ambassador of the yards would know I'm following my father's quest, of course. I wanted to pick up where Cosmir left off, so I quit my job in the treetops and spent all my Zorkins on a diving suit that doesn't really work. You're joining my quest then? Well, that depends. Um, are you taking no? <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like a yes. Come, much work to be done. As my father used to say, practice makes perfect. It sounds like a yes. Oh, that was that was good. That was good. That was good. Someone canceled the conversion ceremony? The invaders did. They shut down the Daokas, the portals that connect all villages on Adelpha. Now, the trip to the Well of Essence is way too long and dangerous. Very optimistic. The master of ceremonies of Palana can't perform like the sacred him. ritual of conversion anymore. Even the reverting ceremonies have stopped. Where is the Well of Essence? Young Talans have used the Daokas to visit the Well of Essence for countless moons. It's in Shamazar, a land far, far away. You can't access it on foot. At the Well, Hirax performs their conversion ceremonies, but he hasn't been able to since the invasion. There's a whole generation of Talans who have left Kizar, but they're still unsure of their essence. It's a generational, existential crisis. So, that's bad, right? Yes! A Talan's life is dictated by their essence. Now, a generation of young Talans like me have... options. It's a nightmare! <laughs> uh... What happened to Procreana? Bad things. Focus on the good, Doc. The good. Tell me more about Hatso. Hatso has been the leader of Amiya for as long as I can remember. After what happened to Procriana, he doesn't want Amiya to fight back. He fears we would be reverted. But his passive strategy won't last very long. Your old man around? Kind of. He reverted at the bottom of this lake. I tried to save him, but I can't swim and almost got reverted myself. I'm so afraid of the water. Sorry to hear that. You should learn to swim, and practice makes, you know, perfect. Why would you build your cabin by a lake if you can't swim? The Yods laugh at me because I was denied a proper conversion ceremony. They test me again and again with water, but there's no way I'm an Aloe to land. I hate water. Father hated it too. But I will have the last laugh. I will achieve my destiny. 
What destiny would that be? Well, the ancients marked a nearby rock for my father to discover millions of moons later. The engraved stone foretold his only son would find an artifact in a lake. An artifact that would save Amiya from extinction. He tried to claim it for me, but... Water scares me even more now. Can I have a look at the rock you're talking about? My father showed it to so many people. He even made me memorize it in case it was destroyed. No one believed us. Of course! My father told me everything about the savior of Adelpha. It's you? That's what Liaz seems to think. I don't remember much of my past. The Yods have planned our encounter. I will show you the engravings, Ulukai. Together, we can save Amiya on your way to saving Adelpha. Sure. Who am I to go against that level of enthusiasm? What is this relic you're looking for? That is not exactly clear to me. But Casimir told me it would save my village from the invaders. If the engravings are right. So it's a weapon. You're the Ulukai. You tell me. No bother. I trust the Yods in their great design. We must make haste, though. Amiya is in danger, and Hatso, our leader, can't protect us. Show me the engraved stone. Follow me. Here it is. Hold on. What's the matter? You go ahead. I'm not worthy to face my father's hazardous yet. What is this? Don't touch it! It's ancient magic! What the... Chalk? Ulukai? Are you alright? Um, Dak... <laughs> you should come and have a look at this. God's almighty! You touched it! What have you done? Casimir always forbid me to... Oh... Unless the ancients were into childish doodles, I think your dad was having a bit of fun with you. It's all... It's very confusing. When was the last time you came here? I was young and naive. There is no artifact. No adventure. I have ruined my life for a false prophecy. Sometimes memories play tricks on us. You know, we see what we want to see. He lied to me. Filled my head with fairy tales. I am so stupid. I should plan my reversion now. Get it over with! Look, Casimir might have elaborated on his story to make it a bit more entertaining. Kids get easily bored, There's you know. nothing in the lakes. Pretending there is won't honor my father's memory or mine. Wait a minute. Your dad didn't draw everything on this rock. There are ancient symbols here, see? I see what you're doing, but Hatso is right. I have to grow up. Have a look for yourself. See those shapes there? I think I know what they are. An X marks the spot. Whoa! <laughs> oh my god! You're right, Ulukai! It's a map of the lakes, and there must be something in that one. We're so close! I can feel it, partner. We're partners! Partners? Uh oh. Hold Help me. Horses, Doc. Help I me. I don't want to be his partner. I have my own agenda, you know. I am so excited! You have to dive into the lake, Ulukai. You have to save Amiya! Are you even listening to what I just... Nope. <laughs> He's not listening at all. <laughs> Oh my. Yes, he is fun to be around. Adventure. Okay. okay, may map should be Hell? Oh, joy. Of course they're there.
Well, they're gone now. Dive it in. I can't do that yet. Oh my God. I can't believe it. Okay, fine yard. So we gotta push this thing all the way to a meet. <laughs> oh, Just uh, at the office. <sighs> Fun times. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there it is. Okay. Where is it? There you are. Okay, is that it? I don't see any more on the map. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay.
crystals. Too close. Make room, my friends. I have a clear shot. Hey, Robin Hood, lower the bow, okay? I don't take orders from you. Fair enough. Whoa. Whoa. Everybody, calm down. This dirty piece of trash smells terrible. Why have you brought this here, stranger? I command you to dump it back where you found it, at once. Hatso, listen to me, Doc. I... we found the relic Casimir was looking for. Of course, you are behind this, you babbling simpleton. This is going to save the village from the invaders, just like the ancients predicted. Nonsense. Do you want to get us all reverted? What? No. There is nothing to see here. Disperse before the invaders spot our gathering from the sky. It looks like the planet. Okay, where did it go? You say it that it was okay. You say it. You say it's not the same as I am. That's disconcerting. Kaze. Milop. I don't want to talk to him. Oh, but he lives again. You don't see many Talans packing heat around here. Nice bow. Thank you. I am Azan, protector of Emiya. Who are you? Cutter Slade, aka the Ulakai, or so I'm told. This place seems peaceful enough. Get much protecting done? Well, you never know when the Kaminai will strike. When it does, I'll be ready for it. How come you're still shooting your bow? Isn't Hatso the one calling the shots around here? Hatso has been our chief for many moons now, but there are people criticizing his policies. They want a new chief. I thought traveling all the way to another dimension would spare me from politicians. Ah, <laughs> uh, nope. who are you again? Hassan, protector of Emiya. Have you seen Doc's artifact? Well, I shot an arrow at it. It's resistant. However, Doc totally lost his essence and stoned me away. It's a fascinating object, though. I just need a good excuse to approach it again. 
Are Cam and I dangerous? Not after I nailed their wings to a tree. My aim is true. My punishment swift. So you're more of a hunter with animal cruelty issues. I am a protector. Citizens of Emir don't hunt. Oh, that's so they do not up. eat meat. On my way then. Let's hunt come at night together sometime. Okay. I guess your dad wasn't the nut job people say he was. Here's your artifact. I only wish he could see this. This... It's so... I have no clue what this is. That makes two of us, but hey, it levitates. That's a start. Not sure how we can use this to fight the invaders, but let's find out together. Your destiny weaves into mine, Ulukai. My father would have been proud. There are a lot of people in Emiya. You think someone would know what this thing is? No one knows. It's too... Wait, Nemeth! He's the oldest Talon in town! He has read many scrolls, even some of the most ancient ones. Maybe he has a clue. Could you please talk to him? I have to stay here and guard the artifact. People are getting too curious, especially Azan. The light at the engraved rock. You really think it's your father's spirit? What's a spirit? It's Cosmere's Hazardous. He reverted before he could accomplish his destiny, so his Hazardous lingers here, unable to journey to Palana until we finish what he started. Cosmere has to find peace before he reunites with the odds. This thing's solid. I pushed it all the way here. It doesn't even have a scratch. I hear something inside. Something loose? Broken? I don't hear anything. It's fine, Doc. No stress. <sighs> You're probably right, Ulukai. Do you see Nemet often? Uh, yeah. I hurt myself a lot, even though I never fell from a tree during the harvest like other Talans. My quest can be dangerous sometimes. Come see me anytime. Okay, I'm looking for a I don't want to talk to you. Yep, there we go. Ah, there's the artifact. They strapped it down. Okay, of course they did. Hello, Shamaz Nemet. You returned. 
Here, kill you me. heal me. Brace yourself. The odds guide my hands. Can I ask how old you are? Older than a fresh hoti and younger than a fey tree. You are the master of being vague. I'm the master of controlling my emotions. Expect anger and rage next time you ask a male to learn that question. Didn't mean to offend you, Nana. The reason I ask is this thing we dredged up from the lake, it seems really old. Like, ancient. I thought a guy with your experience uh, came across it in a scroll or something. Hmm. I recall no description of such an object. And I've read my fair share of scrolls, both mundane and sensational. The item looks like it's from a pre-Talan era. Where can I find informative scrolls? Maybe Doc can read them to me. Doc wouldn't know where to start. Most treetop inhabitants can't read, except maybe for more who took late classes. Your best chance would be to ask a scholar at the Dano Library. Yeah, I think I lost my library card. Can I borrow yours? Ah. Uh, a joke. Was it funny? Forget me <laughs> for not laughing. Humor harms the purity of the essence. <laughs> uh, forgive me for not laughing. I didn't know it was funny. Where is the Dano Library? Good question. Does it still exist? <sighs> was the Dano Library totally destroyed with the bombing of Procreana? Or does just a sliver still remain? You should go and find out. Pain in my Were bottle. all the scholars uh, reverted to? There must be survivors. I heard the assistant of the head librarian dodged a reversion the day the invaders unleashed their wrath upon Procreana. If he's alive, he must be very, very old. Sounds like I should find him soon, then. Who is he? His name is Kureg. His ears were already shot when I was borrowing scrolls in my young age. I can't imagine the bombs helped his hearing. He might be the best hope to understand your artifact. He spent his whole life studying old scrolls that are now lost forever. Kureg, huh? I'll try to find him. Thanks, Emmett. I would say good luck, stranger, but you make your own luck. Remember that. Yes, have you heard about this Kureg guy? I was about to call you Ulukai. I made a strange discovery. And since you have to go to Procreana, I'm activating Adaoka so we can talk face to face. All right. Oh, jumping in the first Daoka now. Let's meet. Well, that's a far piece away. The odds are trying to show me something with these visions. What? Are we gonna see mommy? Ah, uh, let's talk a little bit first, baby girl. Just you and me. Come here. Whoa. You brought me a present? From another world? Oh, well, technically another dimension. Uh, sure. My friend Zokra must have stashed it there before I... It's for you. Here. It's an amulet, made out of one of the magic stones they have on Adelpha. Mom got one too? It must look so good on her. Listen, Camilla. I have to tell you something. That's the amulet they were talking about. You'll have to be strong, baby girl. Her mom died? 
Or is he telling her he can't come back anymore? That's the amulet Leas was looking yep. for when we met. Guess I had it after all. Before I gave it to Camilla. Away we go. You made it. How did you turn that on? It's the strangest thing. Remember where my Dolotai got abducted the moon we met? I found a Dioka core at that exact location, almost as if someone put it there on purpose. That woman I saw, she must have used the core as a friendly gesture. I think she wants to negotiate with you. Negotiate? Do you know how many talents the invaders have reverted in the last couple of moons alone? I won't fall into their sneaky traps. I don't know what to tell you, Liaz. The Yods send me those visions, and I don't know if I can trust them. Anyway, thanks for the trip. Can you show me where I can find Kureg? The old librarian. You should find him at what's left of the Dano Library. Cool. I've only met him once, after the bombing. Good luck talking to him. Wait. Why would I need luck? <laughs> You'll see. Okay. Well, that can only be something good. That's what that is right there. Oh, I can see the fog again. Maybe it happens in every section you're in. Yeah, okay. Every section you start a new to be in, it's going to be story locked until you go to the main story in that section. Okay. Maybe. We shall see what we shall see. They're on me. Oh, hell no. for that a whole horde of lizard things Very pretty. 
crystals. There you go, there are consumables. What does it say about this? Take the right hand path. Is your opinion about this game now, sir? Still liking it or Mula? I'm I'm liking it. I'm I'm going to have to get used to. You know, when you go into a new section, it's basically story locked until you complete the story. You know, go to the main person you have to see. I can understand that. There is a part of me that just wants to go everywhere and see everything, but once I unlock. All the different places because then i can go everywhere and see everything because i'm going to have to do that in order to complete the mission of entwining everything finding out how everything's connected so this is a long way away oh you know this is a, a definitely a marathon game it's gonna take a long time okay and i need could go straight up, but I want to hook around. What is this? Oh, there's a base up here. Okay. But not what you expected. Once it is connected, you can go anywhere. Yeah. Once it's once I unlock all the dokas, once I get to the unlock all the main uh, missions in each section, I'll be able to go back and forth all over the place, which is something I'm going to be needing to do. Because you just can't just do everything in one section and think you're done. One village is going to be dependent on another village once they're done, because once the portals are open, so you have to communicate, you know, connect them, different villages, and see how they interact with each other. Okay. This one. Touched it and now there's purple haze. What does that do? You know, what is causing? Oh, it's gonna be that bird up there. Yep. That's the enemy thing. That's on my radar. Okay, I can't go much farther because I've been into the clouds, the mist. Misty mist and the dusty dust. I see you're full of talent, Ulakai. I'm sure you didn't call to flatter me, Lias, so. 
21. To humbly offer you a token of the Dolothai Guardian's gratitude. I've marked a position on your map. It's a surprise. A mystery prize? You definitely know how to push my buttons, Lias. I can't wait to look this up. Slay it out. Mm. You little sack of noise so hi lamest it's been a minute since you streamed oh yeah okay there's still a bunch from here Weapon module. Cool. All right. Show effects. Increased damage of chances of stunning joy. The weapon can be shot. Okay. Okay, so it'll go. I can hold it. much better. Dang it. That's not luck, that's skill. It is much better. that still says there are at least two more here somewhere <coughs> oh, 
this direction. Sticky mines. Oh, I love sticky mines. Sticky mines are some of my favorite mines. What was that? Can I talk to you? Are you returning a scroll? If you're late, it's going to cost you. It's surprising to meet a librarian around these parts. Barbarian? Yours? No! <laughs> I'm Professor Curing, the librarian. If you want to continue this conversation, the Dana Library accepts donations. Uh. I want to make a donation to the library. No, thank you. Fruit upsets my stomach. But the library needs donations. Zorkin, stranger. Hey, read my lips. Who are you? No need to shout. I'm Churik, the last librarian of Procriana. What happened to Procriana? Yes, I have lived in Procriana all my life. Oh, wow. This is going to be interesting. Emia, you and me. Let's go. Why would I go to Palana? What? <sighs> no, listen. Emia, Morax. Mmm, delicious. Yep. Not. Whatever. They need your help with a giant rock of some sort that is at least as old as your ears, pal. Capiche? <laughs> no, no, no. I don't eat more eggs. Too sweet for my teeth. Okay. You coming with me to Emiya now? Yes? Yes! Hallelujah. Let's go. Go? Where to? <laughs> uh. Don't you get it? The trees. The fruits. Emiya. Do you expect me to walk to him here? My old legs won't allow it. I haven't let Procriana since the Dauka went down. When a Talon reaches my age, every step counts. No Dauka, no Curic. 
Okay. See you later then. Except the Don't shirt. You curse at me. Oh dear lord. <sighs> Where's the Dioka? Okay, skill tree. Great, now I can glide. Uh, air dodge. Oh, it's a jet sprint. That's what I can do now. Didn't glide. Uh, jet sprint boost. Okay. Now I can. That should be a theme park ride. Nice. All right. That's wait. No, yeah. You and I have met before. Oh. Don't you get it? Do you expect me? I don't want to keep you. Okay. It's unlocked unless I have to unlock it from this side. I don't know. It's... Fucking my fuck. I swear the odds. Don't hurt me. <sighs> no one's hurting you. I'm a friend of the Talans. Ask anyone about Nurkan. They'll tell you I'm just an honest merchant who keeps to himself. Leave my shop, please. It's all I have left. Even my pride is gone. I'm not going to take your shop. What is wrong with you? I know who you are. You're one of them. Them who? The invaders. You saw invaders who look like me? Like flesh and bone, not metal? After the attack on the city, they came out of their ships to make sure all the recreators were reverted. They were just like you. As I hid, I saw them execute dozens of my friends, even my business partner. Please don't hurt me. My memory is Zord. I will forget your face as soon as you leave, I promise. Are you a friend of Kurag? Not a friend. No. I know him. He was my teacher of ancient history at the university. A bomb fell close to Kurag when the Dano Library was destroyed. It's a miracle that the old timer survived, but his ears shot to Zord. What was your name again? I'm Nurkan. I sell useless junk. But it's good useless junk. Business partner, what's your business? Oh, I suppose you've never seen a recreator workshop. It's very, very different from this shop. This is my souvenir shop. You talk mm. like someone who has something to hide. No, no, no. Nothing to hide. Look, I can offer you a good discount if you leave me alone. You won't find any recreators here. They're all gone. All but one, it seems. You're a recreator, aren't you? No! I... Sort! How did you know? <laughs> I worked undercover before. You could use some practice. Don't worry, I'm not with the invaders. I didn't know there were invaders on our side. And I didn't know there were recreators left alive. I can't wait to tell Leaz about this. I... I am the last of my kind. All my brothers, 
They collaborated with the Dolatai Guardians, and they all paid with their lives. I have heard of Lias, but I don't want to make the same mistake, so please. I understand. And I'll keep your identity a secret. I promise. He's Thank all you. alone. I'll do whatever I can to help as long as I'm not exposed. I'm sure he'll find out he's not. What does a recreator do these days? I'm retired. I sometimes practice my craft on personal projects, but nothing that... No. I'm retired for good. I see. Ah, too bad. Could have used someone with real skills. To do what? Not that I would be able to help or anything, but... Just out of curiosity, I mean. What would you need a recreator for? Forget I even said anything. Enjoy your... <laughs> Wait, why? <laughs> Some people have to fight for the Talans, and time is running short. My best recreation days are behind me, but... Actually, I can still create all sorts of things. It's in my essence to do so. Do you have anything specific in mind? I mean, I need plans. I can bring you plans. Thanks, Nurkan. Keep a low profile, man. Okay. Ah, oh, there's one here. It's all right. Why are there two so close? I came in one that wasn't that far away. How am I supposed to keep an eye on you if you keep sneaking out? My father executed four prisoners today. Four. Just because they won't tell him how to access that damn island. He has no choice. What we need is on that island. I'm the negotiator on this mission, so let me negotiate. We don't have to torture them. I'm with you, but you don't understand. I promised your father that I would take care of you. Well, this is your chance to do it. Cover me while I establish contact. Sure. I mean, that doesn't look like a floating weapon to me at all. Yeah, it's that one. Not ah, crumbs. You and I have met before. <sighs> You think? Look, an artifact was uncovered at the bottom of a lake in Emiya. You may be the only Talan alive to know what it is. I need your help. Can you come to Emiya with me? What's the secret code? A oh, code. God. Why did I think this would be easy? If you don't know the code, I have nothing to say to you. If you do, speak now. But be aware that there won't be any second chance. The wrong password will seal my lips forever. <sighs> can I get a hint? No, I can't sprint. I'm so uh... old that I can barely walk. But I'll give you a hint. Uh -oh. You can find the secret code in an ancient scroll titled The Lost Art of Asking Things Politely. 
Can you come to Emiya with me, please? Goodbye. Lead the way. Oh, God. The pain. The pain. Here we are. The relic is right there. Oh, I have to go into the Doc. center thing. Anything new? Ulukai, you're back! By the yards! This is fascinating! Easy now. <laughs> Relax. The scholar's with me. It can't be. This shouldn't be here. I knew it. Is this thing going to explode? No, it's not mold. These are just plants covering the surface of the egg. Did you say egg? What kind of monster is in there? Mother? It's, it's not a mother. It's a baby. The first born Galenta in thousands of cycles. Oh my god! I'm gonna have a baby! Oh my word. Can you make it stop? Come on, baby critter. Shed that shell off. Professor Kurek? Kurek. Remember me? I can't wait to write this in a scroll. I can't wait to study the scroll I wrote. Rayfar's going to be so jealous. Do you know any recreators? Most recreators have been reverted by the invaders. Their alliance with the Dolatai Guardians is the reason why Procreana is almost abandoned today. A couple of them might have survived, but don't expect them to brag about their craft. Can you tell me more about Galenta? No Talon has ever seen one. The oldest scrolls merely repeat stories found in the ancient temples, and they are quite abstract. I'm so excited to document the whole incubation process. Good. Excitement keeps us young and curious. How long will it take for the egg to hatch? The process started as soon as the egg entered our warm temperature, but it's not warm enough for it to proceed. It needs outside help. <laughs> so what? Should I sit on it for a few weeks? We need to quickly raise its internal temperature. Find some covers, like warm blankets that retain heat. Hurry, or we could lose the Galenta forever. Is that all? We also need Z-Dog sap. It heats up quickly under the sun. The covers and the sap would combine to form a warm cocoon to incubate the egg. Do you want to talk about what happened to Procriana? The memory is too long and painful for me to tell. But ask people at the Dolatai camp. It all started with them. I'll ask Liaz about it. Thanks for the tip. An egg, huh? Wait. Is there a gigantic mother somewhere? No. Galentas were extinct before the first Helan appeared on Adelpha. The cold temperature of the lake must have preserved the egg during all those moons. It's still alive. I don't know about you, but to me, Galenta sounds impressive. Not placenta. <laughs> Galenta. Remind me why you need sap for the egg. Now you don't drink sea dog sap, you <sighs> fool. It's for the egg only. It will help seal in the heat and accelerate the incubation. You got any covers on you? I will keep my clothes on, thank you. Ask the weaver, quickly! What happened in Procriana? Of course something happened in Procriana. I was there! Fine, I won't tell you the story since you don't want to hear it. I miss the old days. Uh. 
gather ingredients. Heat up set. Oh man. Let's track that one first. Chief Hadzo. That's right. I am the chief, and I'm ordering you to move your piece of junk. Could you spare some blankets for the egg? Blankets? You're right, stranger. We need covers to hide that thing from view. You should talk to Zotil and see what he has in stock. Yeah. Always a pleasure to see you leave. Oh, I'm going to be so much happier when I get his ass kicked out of office. It's going to be a long time coming, though. Cutter Slade, and you are? You don't know? I am Zotil, the most spectacular weaver in all of Emia. And most humble. And also the only. Love the shirt. Where did you get it? Uh, thanks. It's a limited edition. Let me know if you're willing to sell it to me. Okay. How do you like Namet's style? I love the new Shamaz collection. Much brighter than last season's. Oh, Have you work. spoken to Doc recently? Doc is a strange customer with strange requests. I broke three needles trying to sew his waterproof suit together. But hey, he pays. And Zorkins are never strange. Are they, stranger? Who are you again? Hello, Zotil. Ah. I'm only the most fantastic weaver in all and of the And the only media. one, I'm sure. Do you agree with Hatso's decisions? His clothing decisions? Yes. Hatso is one of my best customers. Uh. And Mia needs a sharply dressed leader, don't you think? Does it? Does it really? I know it's not exactly the season, but I'm looking for a blanket. It's got to be thick and warm and large. Really large. Got anything like that? I don't. But if you dream it, I can make it. That's the burden of being a genius. Great. I'll take five large blankets. I'll pick them up later. Not so fast, Ulukai. We must discuss colors, patterns, uh. trims. Just choose the ones you like, okay? One more thing, Cutter. To weave your blankets, I need certain materials, and I can't leave the shop right now. What do you need? If we want these blankets to be extra warm, the fibers of the Kolvar plant would be perfect. It grows close to the hollow tree. Okay? Jeez, can you get a little more specific? How do I find this place? Excuse me, can we adjust the attitude? If you walk west from Emiya, you can't miss it. It's a massive hollow tree. The hollow tree. Get me? Yeah, that's a huge help. Thanks. Any reason you don't want to go? 
It's not the safest of trees. It's haunted because of the terrible, long-forgotten rituals that took place inside of it. And it's also infested with deadly flying Kamenai. Not my scene. Oh, Cam and I are bad news? Uh, yeah. Hello? If you enter their territory, they swoop down and tear you apart. I could have a Zan escort me, but he stinks of meat and his fashion sense is hideous. Okay, let me get this straight. You want me to risk my life fighting a flock of killer birds to get you the plants you'll turn into a bunch of blankets? This at least gets me a discount, right? I'll give you the blankets for free. Just bring me a few extra plants for the winter. Deal. And consider adding your flamboyant shirt to the deal? No deal, man. It's the only one I have. How will I recognize the Kovar plant? You can't miss it. It's the only plant that grows in the hollow tree. So how many plants do you need? To make a blanket? A lot. Get to it. More Kovar, please. Do you have enough Kovar plants to... I don't. Anything you can tell me about Azan? Azan. Azan. Ah, uh, yes. Young, rugged, dumb as a Twanha. He's our resident hunter. Or is it protector? Whatever he calls himself, these boons. I won't go near him. He's around meat all day, and the stink sticks to his clothes. Yuck. All right, I'll get going then. You go. <sighs> I'll focus on my masterpiece. Put your next delivery on the table over there. As long as the Kovars keep flowing, Zotil will keep sewing. And I still want that shirt. <sighs> yeah, 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 yeah. It's never easy. Slade, they're coming. Ulakai, watch out. You're approaching a Gork eruption. Do you see it? A, a what now? Yeah, you don't get these kind of calls sitting behind a desk, I'm telling you. Gork has been erupting from the depths of Adelpha. It started with the invasion. Jan saw it as some kind of natural defense mechanism triggered by the planet to fight our enemies. But Gork can infect animals and turn them berserk. So please be careful. Okay, I'll put a cork in that. Gork. It's laid out. Damn it. Okay. Okay. Someone on this channel, please come in. What uh -oh. the? <sighs> Who are you? I can never pretty anything but good. Don't remember? We're not exactly friends, but I could be a valuable ally if you want one. You're with the invaders. Invaders? Guess that's one way to put it. Yes, I'm with the WFA, but I disagree with our general's leadership. And that's supposed to make me instantly trust you. What's your name, soldier? How about I remain anonymous and offer you a much better weapon as a gesture of goodwill? If you're trying to buy me, add a foot massage. My boots are killing me. That's sarcasm you can't fake. Commander Cutter Slade. It's really you. In the flesh. Am I famous or something? Unbelievable. This is a game changer. I... I'll be in touch. Hey, hold on. If you know me, you might know my daughter. Her name's Camilla. Damn it. Tell her I'm coming home soon. I'm sorry. I can't get involved in your family affairs. Find the gear at the coordinates I'm sending you. I deactivated the security system so you can enter the facility. But be quick. I don't know how long it will last. 
Signing off. Fine, I'll do it. At least tell me how Camilla's doing. Hello? How hard is it to answer a simple question? That implies you don't understand how much time has passed. You picked the wrong target, bird. Somewhere. Where are you? Ah. Okay. There. Keep doing that. Golden mushroom. Oh, crap. <laughs> the dynamite all right oh crap of course oh crap you're going to gather the diamonds that the almayel requested that's the official plan we asked listen I figured that the Daramons are one thing, yes, but if I'm going to seek support in every village, I'd rather use the help of your fellow Tohans to destroy the invaders' bases one by one. But I thought the message from the Yods was about procreation and protection. Am I missing something? Come on, Lias. If you left Kizar, it's because you know the Almael are disconnected from reality. They don't understand who they're up against. Not like the Dolotai Guardians do. I know. Don't get me wrong. I know Okastok and the Spear are important for your culture, and I respect that, but the priority is to get the invaders off your world so Talans are safe and the Yods can send me home. You're right, Ulokai. I'm sure every village has something to offer in the uprising against the invaders. You just have to figure out what. Pian would be... I don't see any more. And ah oh, shit, here they come. Oh, what the? I've smelled nicer things. I don't have time for you right this moment.
Traitor. That's uh, herbalist. Hey there. Any goods to sell? The Dauka allows me to restock. Do you have any Zorkins for me? Ooh, Regulatium. Shiny and valuable mushroom. Okay. Hi there. Looking to buy something? Ocean. Okay. Shield of the creation. Okay. Probably those plants that were making an aura around them. Seagox sap. Good. That's what I need. Sea, sea duck. Sea duck sap. Okay. How much? Hey there. Any goods to sell? The Dauka oh. allows me to restock. Do you have any Zorkins for me? Okay. I need sea duck sap. Really? That got me four. How sad. Um, where is he? Back in there. It's too far away. Can't be. I wish there was a better way to figure out where the heck everybody is. Hey. Yes, yeah, the hunter again. Need that 
that's that guy again. Here. Oh, it is. Son of a bitch. Okay. Okay. Got you. Yay me. do I have? Cause I ain't got no hell. Oh, 
That did. There's some kind of momentary shield or stamina. What I need right now is help. I got enough, finally. Jeez. Like half a bar of life left. So Teal started to wrap the egg. Looks cozy. Hey, Doc. How's the egg? Look! Do you see those strange bubbles on it? I can't figure out what they are. Did you hear what Kureg said? I can't believe this! We're having a baby, Lukai! I wouldn't have put it like that, nope. but I guess you're right. We must collect the resources Kureg needs for the egg. It's like my father told me. No one is coming to save you. You have to do it yourself. <laughs> Your dad sounds like my dad. How about I get the covers and you deal with the ZDOX app? Split the work, 50-50. I don't think so. 
Z dogs are dangerous, and the egg needs someone close and caring, waking at all times like a good mother would. Uh, yeah, about this mother business. You know you're using the wrong word, right? But I'll help you anyway, Doc. You are the baby's only hope, Ulukai. I trust you. Ugh, the pain. The pain. Until next time, Doc. I can't wait. Sadly, I know that's true. Okay, I've deposited both things. So. Incubation. Oh, he's still making the covers. Okay, I got you. I got you. Let's see. All the covers are made. And it adds with this. And then we get this. And then we get this. What is this? Where is he? Oh. This should be extra fun. You look worried, Greg. What's up? We'll discuss that after our urgent matter. I'll be discreet so the kid doesn't hear us. He's way too anxious around the egg and I don't want him to freak out. So, what's so urgent? A Galenta mother uses her trunk to eat the parasites that develop on the surface of her egg. This phenomenon seems to occur after the shell reaches a certain temperature and releases a very specific type of... Too many details. All you have to know is the egg has parasites and we have no trunk to take care of them. So these bubbles are parasites. I see. Pay attention! I said parasites! <sighs> if we don't do anything, these filthy organisms will breach the egg before it's time. The baby Galanta won't survive a premature birth. So what can we do about it? <laughs> Your tongue is not long enough, but I appreciate the gesture. Yeah? Tonha! Tonha could help us, yes! And I've said, time is of the essence. You can ask Doc where you can find some Twana, but do not tell him why. The kid already makes me nervous as it is. Do what I say, now! How many Twanhas do you need? Don't be so cheap. One is not enough. As a matter of fact, too few of them would only slow down the propagation, but not stop it. We need a whole pack of Twanhas to save the egg. Where can I find a Twanha? They don't sell Twanhas in Procreana. Ask around! I don't want to keep you. Uh. Hey, Doc. How's the egg? Look! Do you know where I can buy a Twanha? There are no Twanhas in Amiya. We wouldn't interfere with the sweet smell of the village. Hats those orders. You should ask more about that. His network of merchants is larger than mine. But why would you need Twanhas? Is there a problem with the egg? A problem? <laughs> what problem? Ah, it's all good. Trust me. Until next time, Doc. I can't wait. Hi there. Got some questions. Yes? 
Tell me a bit more about Tuan Haas. Not much to tell. They're stubborn animals used for pulling carts and other hard work. If you want to buy a Tuan Ha, you should go to Bida. What can you tell me about Emiya? Emiya was built around Ganzar's remarkable trees over the course of thousands of moons. Our main source of income is the harvest of the delicious Morag fruits. Who's important around here? Our current chief, Hatso, and our resident Shamas, Nebit, are both ground citizens and the most respected Talons in the village. See you around. Come back anytime. What's this here? What's up, Moore? Find any new climbers? No one as valuable as Doc. Do you need Tuan Ha merchants? I need to buy some. Then you are up for quite a journey. There are no Tuan Ha's in Amir, or anywhere close for that matter. So, where can I strike a deal then? Your best chance is the village of Bida. Kartak is breeding exceptional Tuan Ha's there. Heard you can even ride some of them, which sounds quite silly. Kartak from Bida. Understood. Tell Kartak that more sent you. You get the best price. Him and me go way back. <laughs> I remember once we had so much lampy to give her that. Hmm. Scrap what I just said. Don't tell Kotak anything. Don't mention my name at all. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thanks anyway. Thanks, Moore. See you around. Tell Doc he can come back when he runs out of Zorkins. Or Dignity. Whichever comes first. Okay. Now we go. Hey, fella. I hope you don't bite. I didn't help my health. Giant alien spiders. Ooh. 
you like the game so far? Yes, it's pretty good. You have to get used to how things behave within the game. Like, uh, each section is used to be uh, locked until you do... Because there's usually a story, a reason for you being there, and you have to unlock that, and then once you do, you can go back. Ooh, I'm not strong enough for that. Uh, right now... I need Tuan Haas. I need a creature. You help with an egg. Yeah, you see this? Okay. Gives me avatar vibes. Yeah, it's described as basically Avatar before Avatar was Avatar. Also, if you ever seen the movie John Carter of Mars, it's very similar to that as well. Love that movie. There a part two of John Carter of Mars? I don't think so. Come on, Avatar? Yes, there is a second movie. Jump up to three times or glide to it. Got up. Crap, 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 crap. I need 
need health. I need health bad. Well, hello? Yes, I shall. Combat. Okay, so I can armor upgrade to boost armor. No, you have to find plants that are the specific ones that are blue, that regenerate your health. Or if you go to a priest in a town, they'll automatically regenerate your health when you ask them. They'll just heal you all the way up. But it's going to require uh, plants and potions. And I've just started the game, so I haven't gotten that far. Shield. No. Yes. What's this? Ooh. Okay. What do I have? Can't do that. These are the ones I can do. I can do 50. So 100. And this is module upgrade. Unlocks a module. Charge attack. That'll be good. I like looking at the ones I'm going to be able to get. Okay. Oh, cool. Tackling them. Nice. Like a leg sweep. Nice. Can I Watch see the weapon Choo. section after? Yeah. Let's see. It's upgrade. Armor. Always upgrade. Always upgrade my armor first. And then you have your jetpack, which eventually is going to... What? That's what I can do now. I can get a glide suit and glide eventually. Got the battery packs for that. Damn, you know, booster while flying. And oh, nice. Ah, uh, this allows me to float so I can shoot. Nice. Nice. Because it's better to be in the air when you're fighting things than to be on the ground and getting killed. Okay, glide boost allows me to go up. Okay. Okay. Cool. Cool, cool. Uh, okay, cool. I got that recently. Okay, let's see. This is... You have your weapon. Then you have your modules, which are the things at the bottom. The, any of these? And you can plug them in here. You're allowed four modules, right? Nope. Okay. Uh, what is this new module I got? Oh, projectiles release proximity mines on impact. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Hello? Hello. Fancy weapon module. Cool. Yes, please and thank you. Let's see how that works. There's still enemies here. Jesus! <laughs> I didn't even see him. Nice! Nice! Oh, those mines are great. Oh, I love that. Oh, I love that. See how it exploded all over the place? Oh, God, that was so good. <laughs> he didn't pop when I, when I, did, when I did my sight. 
Like he didn't pop. He's different. He's not the robot. You see how he's a different color? There's humans in charge of the robots in each each one. So he's gonna be a human most likely. Or a very advanced robot. But cheese. <laughs> I was not expecting that. The upgrade you just did to your gun. Yeah. It had mines on it. Explosive mines that stick to what you're shooting at. So, yes, and you got that I got that from here, I'm pretty sure. And that the last thing I opened up. So that is a very wanted thing. Oh. That was so good. <laughs> That scared the cheaper straight out of me, man. All right, now back to what I was doing. Okay, wish I had my glide suit already. Yeah, you see that up in the air? That's gonna be the enemy. It's gonna be a way in the future to get into that. Okay, I need to go that direction. What on earth? Howdy, cowboy. Not sure what a cow is, mister, but I know bombars, and I'm a bombar boy. Ozak is my name. Hey, Ozak. I'm Cutter Slade. What are you up to? I'm pushing a herd of bombars that way. Then later, I push it back this way. Circle of life. This particular herd of bombars are the most stubborn creatures I ever met. After Scoot. You got a problem with your herd? You can call it a communication breakdown. I tell Scoot what to do, and then Scoot tells the bombars. Otherwise, they don't listen to me. How hard can it be? They're just... bombars. It's always a hustle to herd them back to the pen. Scoot is a good assistant, but I wouldn't say no to a couple of helping hands like yours. Especially with the Garandars lurking on my herd. Nope, I can't. No, I cannot go up against a Gandar now. It's not going to happen. It ain't that easy, mister. You'll see. So long, cowboy. Don't know what that is, but y'all bless you, buddy. No, I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this. I need to go talk about the Twanahas. Uh, not messing with the no underground worms. No grab boys for me, thank you. On us. I'm Cutter Slade. Good for you. Here uh, you are. Oh, I, yeah. I actually didn't understand what you just told me. I'm a merchant. We're supposed to be polite with the clients. Slade is my name. Very nice. I'm Kartak. I raise and sell Twanhas. Moore sent me to buy some Twanhaws. That tall Zord owes me a brand new Nacog. That's gonna cost you. Look, the animals aren't even for him. I say you throw me your best price, and I'll talk to Moore about his debt. How about that? You're lucky that the Twanha business is slow. Take them, but don't you dare come back without a Nacog, or you'll get the high season treatment. Oh, that doesn't sound like a bad sound. Oh, crap. Am I going too fast? Assessing alien specimen stopped. Return to park. I knew it. Come on. Come on, come on. Crap. Good luck. 
Yes, sir. Love the mines. Sticky mines are my friend. I don't even know. What is that? What I want to know. whatever measurement is on this planet. Great, yes, should be far enough away. Oh, good, got Elon. Good, 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 good. Good, all right. Alien specimen not following. Come on. Crap. What happened? Yeah, that's what happened. Explosive mines. Oh, that was so good. Assessing. Yeah. Alien specimen stopped. Return to path. I will. I need crystals. <laughs> don't kill me. What, Please don't you're not going to follow me? Got to stay on the road. Is that it? Yes. <laughs> Not gonna follow me? No, no, I already gotta know that. stay on the road. Is that it? Yes. All right. How you do that? God, I love that upgrade. I'm so glad I went up there and got that. What is this? What's popping on my radar? Assessing. Alien specimen not following. No idea what that is, but... Okay. 
Definitely need this. What? You're not gonna follow me? I don't care. You gotta stay on the road. Is that it? I need these blue ones. These are for help. Assessing. Alien specimen stopped. Return to path. Gonna follow me? Gotta stay on the road, is that it? Cinematic. Well, that can only be good. Oh, good. I hope it's gonna work. Here we go. Ulukai! Look! Kurig was right! You made it! Wow. Someone's hungry. It smells like... Your ass? A filthy twangha in my beautiful village? They must have lost their mind! Meals on the house, Twan Haas. Ulukai, having trouble activating Beda's master Daoka? We need it up and running as soon as possible. I'm marking a location on your map. You can see the outpost from the village. The core has to be stashed there. I trust your instincts, Liaz. I'll check it out. That can only be found in the wilderness. Slightly increases cutter's resistance damage for. Okay. Okay. So it's damage resistance. Which is not bad. Resources. Talons. Um, Use as a crafting resource. Nano cells. Nano cells are the WFA's latest invention. They've managed to control the chaotic behavior of purple helium, helium, by realigning its crystalline structure. These cells can be used to enhance the offensive capabilities of both droids and weapons alike in near infinite amount of waves. See Bob's stat. Uncommon flower. Smelling this flower makes you feel something you can't describe. It's certainly valuable. Okay. Verdict, someone must be pretty pissed at you too right now. It is certainly valuable. Very shiny and valuable mushroom. Piece of flesh. Got it from a Gungar. After its death, it can be used as a crafting resource. Probably in potions. Just like that. Okay. The items core. Hello. Done. Get back. Shield. Um. Okay. Um, I need to go. Still making the cover, so 
Okay, remove parasites from the egg. I got scored in the back. Okay, then remove parasites egg. Once the parasites have been removed, egg will hatch. Okay, cool. That's currently going. Uh, while that's going, I will go into this most likely trap. So it can't be anything else other than a trap. No one from the opposite side calls you and hey, it says, hey, here's some weapons and stuff. Surely it won't cause any trouble. It'll be all right. Nothing wrong with it. What could possibly go wrong? Flock of killer birds, just what I need. Well, maybe I can outrun them. Like a damn freaking ninja. What the hell was that? damage for a while. Screw you. Who's doing that? Oh, okay. You first. Want some? Come get some. Damn it! <sighs> yeah, I shut down the defenses at the base. I won't be anywhere near when it when I come back. You see that thing in the sky? That's what I'm hatching. Oh, back so in the body. Okay, good. What a trip! So I come back to the near. I didn't know that. Okay. Well, let's get this crystal. I'm going to need it. for me.
Peace. Heels. Okay. There's at least two more. In my way. Mm. Nothing there. Okay. I want to get crystal first. Wait. Whoop. Hello. What are you? Never know. All right. Scan. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Where are you? Oh, spider droid. Nope. I will, thank you. Need that? Yes, I do. Matter of fact, before I go in there, where's that? Okay, over oh, here. I'll collect the other things that I might need down here. Because you know what? a new piece of kit. What is this? Hello? Nano cells. Nano cells. Okay, good. That's not even a really hard fight. Not even kid it out for doing a really hard fight. <sighs> okay. Feel like a trap at all? I don't know. Whoa, whoa! What is it? What is it? Knew it. Little shit. Fucking laser sight. Thank God I saw it in time. Nope. Oh, it reappears? Oh, that's not fair. Okay, it comes back from some it comes from someplace else. Okay. It's like launching there. I just want to pirate. Okay, just want to pirate. Just want to pirate. Just want to pirate. Okay. Okay, I see. Okay. Okay. Move it.
Damn. Any more? Yes, one more up. Down we get get all the goodies that I wasn't able to get because I was being attacked. Okay. All right. Okay. One level up. This wasn't a trap at all. Not at all. Of course, he'll say, I turned it off, and it didn't. You, did, you took your time, and I wasn't able to do anything about that. Slave well, hello. Pull out. You hear me? The general's on his way. I'm not going anywhere. Uh, Slate out. Slade? I know you. You're the problem. You can't be real. I... I saw you die. Well, you know the saying. What doesn't kill you makes you... your punchlines. Commander Slay, how do you plead? Not guilty. Everyone but me was lost in action. It's not my fault. But it was your mission to keep them alive. Instead, you abandoned them and only secured transport for yourself. There was no one left to save except you guys. On Earth. And that's it. All of you. Raise weapons. Aim. You can't even pull the trigger yourself. You're a coward, Jack. For Marion. Fire! That was... Holy shit. Jack Borum executed me. How many times am I gonna let that guy kill me? Okay, my guess is... When he was on Talon Black's time, he was altered so that now he has a spirit like they do, so he can be reborn. And the girl he was talking to, Marion, is his real daughter, that bald guy's, but Cutter is the one that she calls Daddy. Which is why he's so pissed, but it's his own damn fault for being an asshole. Earth, fire, water, air. Okay. You can now alternate between gun and rifle. Rifle consumes red helium. Okay. Anyone want to alternate?
Okay. That should be a quick. I shouldn't have done that. Uh, no. This. Oh, weapon modules. This is a. A charged shot. Okay. Let's see. From a distance, a rifle is usually. Let's see. Ooh, upgrade. Yeah, I'm going to put that there. Should work good. Okay, handgun uses green halidium. Red uses the rifle uses red halidium. Oh, God, I can upgrade. Okay. Let's see. Uh, boost. Air dodge. All right. Hee <laughs> hee. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Not bad. Okay. Uh, reinforce shield. Launch up, take no locks. Really to upgrade your weapon modules on the weapon screen. Yep. Thank you. Yes. Upgrade my weapons. So I can also get my shield reinforced. Yes, thank you. Okay, now we go. Hello. Hello. Not much. Okay, I need um almost halfway there. Yeah, okay. Alright. How is it going? It's pretty good. It's a pretty good game. The beginning is a little bit laggy, you know, trying to get into how I'm supposed to learn. How the game works. But once you do, it starts getting better. Like... this I'm looking forward to getting that that's like later on thing was like way far away that tackle's gonna be good though I like that tackle and the shield dash is gonna be really good the way I function with the game How's your day going? Any special plan today? I mean, besides doing this, not much. All right. Right now, I can do my shield, shield slam. Let's 
you up. Okay, look around. Oh, oh no. Let's not go through there again. Yeah, I need to stack up on these and use them. Need to use them because I am down on my health. Okay, looking for useful things. Useful things. See how this is progressing. Attaching. Okay, good, good. Okay. All right. All right. I know you. Is it working? Of course I'm working. Good job on the Twanas. They have nimble tongues and seem to enjoy the disinfecting. Now, if you would excuse me, I have to document the process as precisely as possible. No, nope. gotta go. Stop saying you were a dollar tie guardian. I don't believe you. Ah, <sighs> Oh, by the way, if you haven't been here for long, this guy cannot hear. Okay. Hmm. That's gonna hatch. Oh. Anything else to add fun?
You did it, Doc. How does it feel? It's the most important day of my life, Ulukai. I'm so excited to finally meet her. Yeah. I remember that feeling. I have a daughter too, you know. The invaders' drones are buzzing around your girl like angry bees. I feared this would happen. Each sting she endures will be a blow to her growth. Can you destroy those drone patrols and keep my daughter safe? Is that a rhetorical question? Your Galenta looks like she's getting bigger by the minute. Not big enough. All this stress has made her sad. I can see it in her eyes. Lucky her. Sadness makes me gain weight. But I can blame it all on a tub of ice cream. This is Adolfa, Ulukai. Here, growth is quickened by happiness. It's important we keep my daughter happy. What do you want me to do? Rub her belly? Take her for a walk? A walk? Yes, exactly! Can you walk her? Doc, I was joking. This is what happens no, when you try to do you sarcasm and people who don't understand it. Taking her for a peaceful, relaxing stroll is just what she needs. Doc, nothing's peaceful and relaxing outside of Amiya. She won't be safe. Do you have any clue how to raise a baby Galenta? I don't need any. I feel it in my essence. A mother always knows what to do with her progeny. Oh boy. <laughs> my baby needs time with her mother. She needs to eat and grow. How about you go hush hush on the whole mother baby thing? I mean, <laughs> is that even legal around here? It's the will of the yod, Zulukai. Do you want to be the father? Oh god. Uh, I, I already got a kid. And they sometimes say two is one too many, and I have all that fighting to do. Wouldn't be home much to provide and all. Know what I mean? It's okay, my friend. You did enough, and the Yods are grateful. It only takes one parent to make things right. I will be a good mother. Go be a good father to your own child, my friend. Get in there. Hopefully. Please, walk her. Bring her ha- Let's do this. Keep it moving. Oh, not those things again. Why are you coming over here? Keep it moving.
How do I switch? About time. Okay. Don't know why it switched to the rifle. I don't recall doing that, but I had to figure out how to switch it back. Handgun. That's what I need. It's the one I've outfitted for being able to do things.
more. Oh crap. Kiss it. All right. The hell? Take that. What the heck was that? Alright, fine. I'm fine. Alright, so... village. Yes, I just did that. Is it cycling?
Do you need a Gandali pot? Let's see. Motion from air essence that increases mobility and airspeed. It's not applied to glide. PS3 hovering and max inertia. So 10 seconds. Okay. Potion. Fire essence increases the melee damage. Okay. Gun potion. Faces cutters resistance to damage. Okay. So that will healing with both the plant mixed with the meat all right okay good all right okay is that symbol No, no, I don't need a fast jump. Thank you. Which I do need that to... What's up, Zatil? Hey! Ready to sell me that shirt? Good meeting you, Zatil. Stay gold, Cutter Slade. Alright. So he's... Before it's this way. He's up there. Okay. I think you can help me. I'd be happy to. Okay. okay. Increases the amount of plants. Okay, I was wondering about that. Okay. You have to come to him for my increase. I have to get Zorkins, which means I have to trade stuff from someone else. 
Or sell. Sell for 40. Sell for 30. Sell for 20. Sell for 15. Just to cool down between each peak and use. Upgrade, upgrade, potions from. Increase the amount of potions you can carry. You should find potions that carry twice. This is the amount of potas can be carried. Right now I can only carry 10, but no, I can carry more. Okay, good. The more resources, resources I can carry, the more I can build. Doc, here you are, partner. Please walk her. Let's go. No, this. not this way. <laughs> Where the hell are you going, Slade? Shit. Nope, not there. Not the way to go. It's red. Oh well. <sighs> okay. Explore every part of Delpha to decipher the clues in the database to gather all. Before I take that creature for a walk. <laughs> okay. I think I'm gonna end stream here. I need to do some IRL things. So, thank you for stopping by. And good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are.
Thank you. Bye.